So now for the Morphe Insider Faves eye brush set. And that's on this box. Unfortunately, I wasn't able to see it online anymore, the descriptions for each and every brush sets. But I am just gonna let you know the names of the brushes instead. And we'll show you how it could be used. Let's get started. This is what we see in the front part of the box. At the top, it says Babe Fave Eyes. And then that's how it looks. And the brushes are actually here. The names and then the photo of it. So that's what's going to be my reference for this unboxing. All right, so let's do it. Unboxing it and then we are going to see it like so. Still wrapped in plastic and then yeah inside all of the brushes are individually wrapped as well like so so now all of the brushes are arranged here according to how they appear on the box and yes let's get started with the first brush right here so still on a plastic and then the names are on this part all right so this first brush is what Morphe called the Morphe E27 Pro Round Blender. This will be used for, of course, blending your eyeshadow. This is called the Morphe E22 pointed blender brush so this one has synthetic bristles and it says smooth things over with this dense blending brush morphe m433 pro firm blending fluff brush so this one has natural hair bristles and it says finally Crease blending made easy thanks to a fluffy yet firm brush. Here, almost similar to the previous brush that I have shared with you. And it's this one, and this is called the Morphe M441 Pro Firm Blending Crease Brush. So this one also has a natural bristles. But it says on the website that this is a popular blending powerhouse with a round and firm brush head and that's perfect for seamless transition and stunning create. Once again, this is the Morphe M441. I just wanted to compare it with the M433, which I unboxed earlier, and it's like this. So the M441 is more taller, more tapered, and has longer bristles than M443. So that really makes me think that the M441 is really much better for the crease blending, and this one could be just be blending when you put um eyeshadows on the lids the morphe m573 pointed deluxe blender brush and the description for this one is that this brush has a thick base and a round tip like so so this one could create soft blown out lines that are perfect for a cut crease and a smoky lower lash line so this one has natural hair bristles this next brush is also included on the morphe babe faves brush set and it's this one so we got a lot of crease brushes here and different hair and this one specifically is called the Morphe M330 blending crease brush 
with a natural hair bristles. Give your crease color the star treatment with a defined tapered blending brush. This next brush, not available on the Babe Faves, but you can still buy it as a separate or individual brush still on the Morphe website. And this one is called the Morphe M139 Tapered Crease Blender. The bristles gather to a point of making this brush perfect for defining the crease. This one has a natural hair. Morphe E17 Crease Precision Blender. Is that this crease brush that tapers to a defined point for targeted placement that still gives a soft, diffused look. Excellent tool for looks involving multiple crease colors. It's a synthetic Morphe M506. And this brush is called Tapered Mini Blender Brush and it has a natural bristle right there. So this small and mighty tapered brush is great for controlled blending. Morphe M321. And this one has a natural hair also. Strong crease color is the name of the game for this dense bullet tipped brush. This next brush is the last brush that's not included on the Babe Faves eye brush set. So all the remaining four are included on that brush set also. Morphe E18 brush. And this one is called a round crease brush. This one has a synthetic bristle. This is shorter bullet tipped crease brush. Will give you a stronger, more defined crease color and is an excellent tool for cut crease looks. Also great for stamping color into the outer third of the eye. So once again, all of these four brushes are there on the Babe Faves eye brush set. And now we are going to the Morphe E36 Detail Crease Brush. So this one has synthetic bristles and on the website it says the perfect fit for laying color right in your crease. Our 12th brush and this one is Morphe M432. It's a flat liner definer brush. So it has synthetic bristles and it says don't let the size fool you. Get in line for a definer brush that goes the distance. So definer brushes like this, I use this for like if I wanted to do like a eyeliner or like a Cleopatra look over here. I could also put some product there and then do a tight line if I wanted to have a, a cream shade on the waterline, eyeliner, gel liner. Also, I could use this if I wanted to put um, a collar underneath or on the lower lash line and then just blend that afterwards to have a smooth look and um, if you want you can also use this to create a wing liner many purpose a lot of people do not like this type of brush but the second to the last brush is this one and i'm really happy that i have this i hope that i have duplicates of this instead and this one has synthetic bristles over here and this angled brush on one end and a spoolie on the other makes this one a must duo. So this will be perfect for eyebrows and could also be used for a wing liner. And last but definitely not the least is this brush right here. Let's open it.
and this is called the Morphe M213 brush. It's a smudger brush and it has natural bristles. On the website it says, you'll be smoking hot thanks to the ultimate smudger brush that has smoky eyes down pat. There you have it everybody. Thank you so much for watching this video and I hope that you like it and I hope that this video helps you decide if you wanted to grab some Morphe brushes. Yes, so I am going to give you an update or probably by the time that this video is up, I have already um, given you some thoughts or I have already used them because really um, I am going to use this entire set as my um, set that I will be using for some clients. Yes, so there and um, I will also share you a video of some other Morphe brushes that I have bought and compare them with this ones. Yeah, so yeah, I hope that you like it and I will see you on my next video. Remember to stay fierce and fly high. See ya.